Hey everyone, it's Rob again. Uh, I'm gonna do another quick battle setup. Um, this time we're going to have more Sturgate ships. Let's do gold. Uh, their mothership. We use the base. Uh, actually, no. Let's try the variant. And we're gonna take six. Six, and we're gonna put them up against uh, armored Voyager. So the scenario basically is the gold will come into uh, the Stargate, or not from the Stargate universe into the St Star Trek universe. And right now they are trying to uh, acquire or destroy the armored Voyager, which is the Earth's at this point in time uh, most powerful ship they have. So, with that said, down to here, soul system, planet number four, which is Mars. And let's see what happens. Yes, sir. Engaging to destroy, Captain. Yes, sir. Evading incoming torpedoes. Moving into attack range. Our ventral shields are draining, sir. Forward torpedo tanks. <laughs> Falling back for an attack run. Sweeping through phaser arcs. The fallen shield is draining. Lining up rear torpedo tubes. Sweeping through phaser arms. <laughs> Lining up rear torpedo tubes. That's it. We got him. Aye, Captain. All stations, damage report. Sweeping Impulse through engines are arcs. fully functional. Warp engines fully functional, Captain. Phaser array is fully functional. Torpedo system is fully functional, Captain. Tractor beam is fully functional, Captain. Sensor system is fully functional. 
Hull integrity at 100%. Shields are at 75%. Yes, sir. So there you go. Nice little fun little fight. Um, I'm going, going to um, introduce other uh, circuit opponents later on. And let's see how how long it takes the uh, Guawu uh, replicators or whatever to uh, finally be able to destroy the armored Voyager. Bye for now.